Hey everyone, it's Jeff with Jeff's Jet Boat, and today we're gonna go over uh, how to sound deaden the noise from the engine in my 08 AR230 Jet Boat. Enjoy. All right, so as you guys can see, my engine mat is pretty much shot. Um, I'm gonna be doing this in stages, okay? So the first stage is going to be what you see here, which is this, um, what they call pipe insulation. Now, what I've gone with is half inch pipe insulation. Now they make two versions of this stuff. They make it in a cheap version and like a good and a better version. What you're going to find is that this foam is a lot just stiffer. Also, the adhesive on it is a thousand times better. Again, I went with half inch. That's what I'm using. So you can see what I've already done. Um, pretty much I went around, I wiped everything off, got all the wax off of it, so I got good adhesion, and I'm just going completely around. Now, when you do this, all my boat had from, that I got, I bought this used, all I had was a little ceiling strip that went around right there, and that was it. Just from doing this, haven't done the sides yet, just from doing this was a massive improvement. Now, I shot video, you can't tell on camera, you just can't. Um, you will tell in your, in, you will tell if you do this. And this is super cheap, and my God, I wish I would have done it a long time ago. So, again, half inch pipe insulation, adhesive right here on the back, and just go around. Um, I bought mine at Menards. Um, it did not make a difference in closing the hatch. What it did make a difference is, see all the black crap? Well, it's kind of hard to see because I've wiped most of it up. Um, what happened is, since I put this on, it is now making contact with all this junk sound deadening shit that's just brittle. So, so now that it's making a good seal, and you can kind of see where it's sitting at, now that it's making a good seal, it's causing this to flake. It's causing all this sound deadening material from the factory to flake off again. Um, I've cleaned it up before. I like having a clean engine bay, and uh, it's just part of it. Uh, my next videos, I'm going to be removing uh, all of the uh, sound deadening material and, uh, and just doing something else. Uh, but as far as quieting down the engine noise, this right here has done a fantastic job. And it's stayed. I've had it on here now for uh, almost a month. The only thing that's happened is I got a little bit of a slice right here from just, I think, the engine hatch closing on it. And, um, and that's it. So I'm just gonna show you how I put this on. It's a no-brainer. If you can't figure it out, you probably don't need to own a boat. And uh, that's it. So here we go. And that, my friends, is it. Super, super cheap. I highly recommend just doing this. I mean, it's the easiest thing you can do. The hatch shuts just fine. Um, and that's it. I did mine three pieces. I did one up here, one down there, and then on the sides. That's because that's just how they sell it. So I hope this is. I hope this helps you guys out. Definitely give it a shot. Next video, I'm gonna be uh, taking all this shit off, the, all this junk off the top, and replacing it with something else. And then that's it. Um, I'm not going any farther than that. If you want a quiet, super quiet boat, buy an IO or your wakeboard boat. It's just one of the downsides. It's one of the cons of having a jet boat. They're just louder. It is what it is. The pros by far make up for it. So uh, thanks for watching. Keep checking out more videos. Keep an eye out for video number two of me uh, doing this, the top. Thanks.